Since the earliest days, man has searched for the soul and tried to define it. In the wilderness, a vision quester seeks a glimpse into what may be the soul or the great mystery. What is the soul? The soul comes from a sacred mountain and it returns to that sacred mountain. Or it comes from Mother Earth and it returns to Mother Earth. Or the soul comes from God. Is it genetically encoded in our DNA? Or the product of centuries of religious teachings dealing with our mortality? Secrets of the Soul takes an all-encompassing look at the soul. From the faithful who hope to touch it, to the scientists who investigate its very existence. This two-hour documentary special explores the Western view of the soul as a way of understanding the afterlife and the Eastern belief that the soul is energy recycled through reincarnation. Christians don't believe that the soul is mere energy. Christians believe that each soul has its own individuality, its own specialness, its own particularity in having been created by God. Without the soul, you don't have a human being. Many have their own view of the soul. I believe the soul is something that we are given that God uh, designates to each one individually. I think of soul as an energy, a force, something that's almost measurable. In the first documented attempt to prove the soul's existence, Dr. Duncan McDougall sought to measure its weight at the moment of death. Secrets of the Soul looks at the latest research seeking to confirm the reality of the soul through near-death experiences, past lives, and mediumship. If mediums can receive communication from departed loved ones who are still continuing their consciousness after they've died, that's one of the fundamental ideas about the nature of the soul. Soul searchers believe that something transcends our physical body. For some, there may be a scientific answer. For others, it's simply a matter of faith.